What about me? What can I do? I need you to stay here with Ben and watch. What? I don't want to leave her here with Ben. You in charge of it, okay? He's fucking useless. You're leaving me with Ben? I'm not his pants are poking out the top of his trousers. That really annoys me. Oh, okay. Yeah, you look after Ben Clementine. Okay. Catch you later, Clem. Stay alive and all that jazz. Let's get out of here. Oh god, this is rank. Let's look at everything. Oh, these are all the rules, look. Waste not. How depressing. Must be the guy <gasps> Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. Mm hmm Okay, I can't go that way. Oh, this is gross. And I can hear all the zombies in the rooms, which is quite creepy. The alleyway to the <gasps> auto Fucking hell, she gave me a heart attack. Coming or not. <laughs> she gave me a heart attack. Shell kissing is right over. Whatever happened here. Oh, can we use them? Are they useful? Already been fired. Mm, I guess. Well, why did it give us the option of picking them up then? Oh, there's a locker here that's apparently going to be useful in the future. Logan's locker. Yeah. Ew. There are zombies in all of these rooms. That's creepy. Oh, I heard something weird then. Can we just go out there? I feel safer out in the alley than I do in this building. Oh god, there's a zombie there. Molly, you out here? She better be. She's supposed to be helping me. What the hell, man? Oh god, glitching out. Looters will be shot on sight. How depressing. Oh my god, what was that? I saw something. Climbing the fence is an option. I need to get over the fence. Oh god, this shelving's gonna fall down, isn't it? Oh, oh wow, I didn't realise Lee was so goddamn acrobatic. What the hell, man? Just that was a pretty big drop. Okay. Must be the entrance to that auto shop where Bree said we'd find that battery. Guess so. Can we open it? Oh, it's gonna take some Damn. take some muscle. Damn. What do I do now? Where the fuck is Molly? Oh god, there's quite a few of them around. Better not get too close. Oh! Oh, fucking hell! The game like froze and I knew something was gonna happen. Leave him! Uh. He's mine. That's where you've been? Yeah, where have you been? Where the hell have you been? While well, I've been doing all the fucking work, you cow. And why are you beating up on some already like dead zombie? He's clearly already dead. Molly? Molly. What? Uh I think you got him, dude. I think you got him. He's dead. One more. Uh, okay. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor. He's bold. We haven't seen a bold zombie yet. Oh dear. Why is she wearing like that mask? Do you turn into a zombie if you like accidentally get their blood in your mouth? Maybe. But the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Use your little thing, your little tool. 
Not a problem. Look what I found. Oh wow, you just like oh, yeah. that'll work. You just pick up these things, don't you? And you don't even know if they're gonna be any use. You're such a hoarder. Uh let's do it quickly if we are gonna do that. Cause um we appear to have gained some some fans, some attention. Shit is right. Rather than just standing there, how about you lift the gate on the fucking garage and get under there? Come on! Mm-hmm. Luckily they don't walk very fast. And some of them are quite fat. Oh god. I didn't realise I was supposed to be doing stuff. Oh god, he's still alive! Quick man. Okay, phew. That's good to know. Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Yeah, you just stand there again and I'll do all the work, don't worry about it. Looks like Crawford had their own semi trucks. These are nice trucks. Hopefully there's no one in here, we didn't even check. Well, I can see where the battery should be. Yay, no battery. Perfect. Well, there's a car up there. Ooh, that car's blinking. That means it's there's a battery. It must be being powered by something. No power. Hey Molly. Something you need? Give me your What was all that about back there? Yeah, what was all that about? He came at me up on that rooftop. Tried to take a bite out of me. So but I you were business. Give it. You got a problem with Well, it was a bit uh, It just seemed like you went to tell Yeah, you did. You were a bit you enthusiastic about that hey, whole situation. You never really know when those things are all the way dead. I guess I'm so. Just making sure. And Look, apparently you, you didn't do a great mind. job cuz he's waiting. actually still alive. I saw him uh So why did you decide to help us? I told you. I'm expecting a ride on that boat once that hillbilly friend of yours has got it running. Uh, uh, you sure that's if all you right? keep calling him that, yeah, he ain't gonna give you a lift, all right? You want to get the damn battery and you're gonna here. you're gonna have to make friends and have what a few more about? social skills. No, no, don't care. As far as I'm concerned, these fuckers got what was coming to them. Oh gosh. Not a lot of sympathy for all the people who died here, huh? I have about as much for them as they did for the sick and the old and anyone yeah, all right. who think was fit to belong Broken to the fucking record. So yeah, fuck em. Um, right, let's... We'll have a look around. You do that. Oh, I just, I really want to just slap her on the back of the head right now. Like, when someone's being really annoying and naughty, you just like, slap them on the head, around the back. You know, clip round the ear, that's it. That's the word I was looking for. <laughs> like, behave yourself! Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. Oh, take Molly some. Let's take Molly's tool again. She won't mind if we borrow it. Well, she probably will, but tough, tough titties. Something you need? Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda. That's oh, what gosh. I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? Just give me the Let's fucking thing, all right? She won't get a scratch. I got your promise now, not a scratch. Well, I saw one on the wall outside, all right. So if if I break it, I can just get you another one, all right? Calm down. Yay! We did it. Progress. It's lowering. Hopefully there's a battery in here. Oh shit, that's not good. No! Well done for pointing out the complete obvious. Okay. Finally something goes right. Well it isn't going very very well, is it, to be honest. Right, we need to undo this. Got that one off! God how it's a good job we didn't need a screwdriver or anything. That would be troublesome. Yay, we got it! Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Just let it go and drop there? it on their heads. Oh, but then we won't be able to get out, will okay, we? Follow me. Well, we're not going to be able to get out that way anyway. You could have dropped the lift on them so that it Move fell on their heads. 
Why don't you just kick the uh, the uh, thing out? The thing that raises the door. Oh god. Go through the roof. We've already made enough noise, I think it's safe to shoot it. Oh yeah, it's alright for some of you some people. We've got you better fucking give me a hand. Oh thank Christ for that. I thought she might leave me behind. And I gave her the battery, didn't I? Okay, so now we're on the roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. The roof is a pretty good place to be. None of them are gonna be agile enough to get up here, I don't think. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump. Uh you had a little tool to uh help you. you. Call me? Yeah, what'd you well, call me? It is a pretty big drop. Go on, you can do it. Yay. I wonder what would happen if I hadn't clicked her hand, whether I just would have like it would have shown him like tomato splattered on the floor. We made it, look, we're back. Oh god, that is a, not Come good. That you can just get into the building like that. Catch you later. What Wait, the hell? Got the battery. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. No. You don't leave without me. Oh my See god. Kenny is gonna Bye. kill me. Damn it, what the hell is she doing? He's gonna be like, I gave you one goddamn task. Goodness. Not good, man. Uh oh. Little help. Ah! Little help here. Oh shit! Shit 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 you Did that not work? Um, I'll smack him in the head. Or I'll shoot him, I guess. Oh, I don't want to brace it with my axe. What am I going to use to kill shit with? I guess... At least... Okay. Maybe they'll get bored and go away. We've got fuel, that's, that's the main thing. each other just yet. Get the hell back to the classroom. It's a hand with these fuel cans. So, Kenny, uh, about the battery, it went pretty well, but I need to speak to you about something. Please don't hit me again. You're back. Clementine! Yeah, you made out pretty good too. Yeah. Great work, Kenny. Yeah, what have you been doing, Ben? I see the How door isn't open. Door? Not so good. Twisting the handle repeatedly ain't hand. gonna help, alright? It's locked. Did you get that battery yet? Why don't you unscrew the yeah, the hinges, well, or just like why don't you just kick it in? She better be. Oh, I forgot, Ben. You're a pansy ass. You can't kick stuff in. Bree. Bree. Hey, Lee. Thanks for all your help. Don't Bree. fucking don't give me your pity party thanks. We're all on the same team. You weren't saying that when you wanted your friends to shoot me. So you're a cancer survivor, like Vernon and the others. Yeah. I was yeah. When I was in college. And then oh, now sense. we've got to hear our whole life story. Starting to get better. I thought there might be some hope. All of this happened. Aww. I lost my whole family. I'm the only one who survived. Funny how things work out. Huh? Join the club. Oh, sorry, God, I fell asleep. Uh. How long have you known Bert? A couple of years. He ran our support group. He was really great, helping me come to terms with my disease. But how do you come to terms with something like this? With a place like Crawford? You I don't. I don't know what I or, or the other survivors would have done without Vernon. He's the one that brought us together. Oh, oh shit. Sorry guys, I just dropped something on the floor. What do you think about this whole Crawford situation? I'd rather not talk about it. Too many awful memories. Alright. Even being back here gives me a bad feeling. Even now, with everyone dead? I got no sympathy for what happened to these people. They oh gosh. The and the old. None of you have really got that much sympathy, have you? Are all, were all of them bad, or were some of them just trying to, like, survive? I consider it poetic justice. Damn, that's cold. That's how I feel. I mean, you were Crawford people once. Just because you guys got kicked out, if you hadn't gotten kicked out, would you have, would you have carried on? If you guys hadn't gotten kicked out, would you have turned into ungrateful assholes as well, who just like watched while loads of people got killed? Hmm. It 
it's very easy to be ignorant, isn't it, when you're on the right side of the uh, tracks. You okay, Clem? Yeah. This desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird. Oh. Being in school. Poor Clem. Well, maybe we can. Um, maybe I could teach you. I was. A, I was a teacher. I only know history. Was I a history teacher? I think I was. Will there be homework? Uh. <gasps> she's like, dang! I wish I hadn't said I miss school now. She had to go run an errand. She fucked off, Clem, with our battery. I hope she's okay. Mmm, she better be. She's pretty tough. Do you think things will ever be normal again? Just like um, no. I don't think anyone knows the answer to this. I don't want to give her false hope. There's somebody out there working on a way to fix this. Some kind of cure, maybe. There's just no way to know. I hope so. Aw, poor Clem. That's good. You hold on to that hope. It's horrible being young in this situation because everyone else, like, will die before you. Like, if all of, even if all of you manage to survive, we're all going to die of old age way before she does. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. Yeah. So where's this battery you found? Um. Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl. But we hardly know her. She saved your life, didn't she? I didn't really trust her with it. She was the only one with a rucksack, and it was too heavy for me to carry because I'm lazy. No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Oh God! Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it, Ben? What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know. Yeah, he's he is. What I know. Oh my God! I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? You tell him the truth, I then, and then he can he can whoop your ass instead of me having to do it. Still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. Um. Ben, no offense, but have you lost your motherfucking, motherfucking mind? mind? Kenny's barely hanging on. Yeah. You tell him you're to blame. I don't even want to think about what he might do. I know. I thought about that, but I don't know how much longer I can keep looking him in the eye. I feel like I'm lying to him. By Just stop looking him in the eye, then. Bad idea. Real, real bad. Hey, maybe you're okay walking around with somebody's blood. Hey, don't be a dick. Just pretend it never happened. Look, we need Kenny. We need him to hold his shit together if we're ever gonna get out of here. So you need to keep this to yourself for the good of everyone. You hear me? Yeah. Hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. Cool. Right. I guess we'll go and see if Vernon and what's her face need any help getting this medical supplies because I don't know why we paired them together. One of them's like too hysterical to do any good, and the other one's an old man, so. Okay. Oh gosh. I swear it was this. Is it this way? I don't think we can go the other way, so it must be this way. My controls are being really... Oh, shit! Uh, stealth. Stealth. Be stealthy. Oh, God. Do we want to shoot them and make loads of noise? I guess. Uh oh. Okay. Now we've attracted all the all the zombies. I suppose they're trapped behind that glass door, aren't they? So it's not too bad. What the hell happened? Oh my god, don't shoot me. They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole oh, Jesus. Place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. Yeah, literally, calm down. Did we find what we need? 
Yeah, that's our other problem. Uh oh. Take a look. Oh no, it's behind the fucking thing. Can't I just shoot it it's out? Like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. Oh dang it. There's no way we can bust it open. And dang it to hell. Time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four digit combination. Well, I doubt they just Cool, so we need to find a we need to find a four. May they might have. Stop being so fucking unenthusiastic. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Cool. I'm gonna find something useful, and then Crystal will be like, "I'm sorry, I was wrong. I'm just being a hysterical woman." What is wrong with these people? Every time, like, someone close to them gets hurt remotely, they just fucking lose their sanity and go crazy batshit. I mean, you have. You need to like learn that in a zombie apocalypse, people are going to get hurt, and you have to remain calm to in order to solve the situation. Korea, that's like a part of your eye. Except it's Korea, isn't it? Your Korea, Korea. Vernon, slow. Chat to me. I'm worried that by the time we manage to get this thing open, it may be too late. Well, fingers crossed. Molly helped me get the battery. That's great. One down. Where is she? Yay! She ran off with it. Had some kind of errand she needed to run. Took off. With the yeah. Don't worry, she'll be back. I hope so. That girl doesn't really strike me as a team. I don't player. sound very sure <laughs> that she's going to come back. <laughs> don't worry, she'll don't be back. Hopefully. You want my medical opinion? The sooner we get him. Well, what other opinion would I? Be asking for. Let's just leave it at that, huh? Cool. Hey, doctor. I just wanted to thank you for coming with us. Yeah, thanks, Doc. I really appreciate it. Don't mention it. It's times like these. We I already did mention it. Most, right? You could just We're be like, no problem, man. Sons of bitches. Sons of bitches. I'll go see if I can find something that'll help us get that safe open. Cool. Good idea. We have a tape now. Let's put the tape in. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547. Dr. <gasps> Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Correa! She looks very sad. Recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh no! That's not oh good. God, oh God, oh God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. Oh no! Tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something. Eventually, I think they're gonna There's notice, no love. All right. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. Oh gosh! Doesn't she get a choice about this? I can't do this. I can't do this. Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later. That's the guy Molly killed, isn't it? No choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. What a dick! Oh dear. That's annoying. He nearly yeah, went we into yeah. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We got to keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. I don't want to go search a zombie. Okay, I guess we're gonna go search this. Nasty man then.